Arise, O compatriot, Nigeria's call obey to serve our Father's land with love and strength. Hi guys, welcome to my channel. It's your girl Nisi and well today or would I say tomorrow is going to be one of the greatest day in the history of Nigeria. It's going to go down as one of the greatest day in the history of Nigeria and I'm doing this video basically to throw out some light and some support towards the citizens of nigeria i want you to know that this election is making a lot of waves people are seriously in tune with what is happening in nigeria and you know a lot of people are rooting for the people's choice now it is very very obvious that the people's choice is mr peter obi or Han or his excellency peter obi and then you know which has other con contenders like tinibu and atiku now this is a very very trying time for nigerians as everybody is facing a lot of crisis with um finances raw cash and um you know fuel scarcity and and you know the whole insecurity issues and nigeria used to be a place that is full of life full of fun and you know a lot of people helping each other i just want to put it out there that people from other countries watching this you might not be able to help out as much as you feel that um nigerians have done for your country when you needed them but the best you can do is Say a prayer for them. Throw out a lot of positive energy towards them. And you know, a lot of encouragement. And what about the Nigerians in Nigeria that are trying to vote? When you go to cast your vote, this is something you have to think about. You're not only... Don't only cast the vote because you want to choose... A man who you want to come and work day and night and break his back and break his neck to give you the change you want you also as you're putting your thumbprint on that ballot paper and voting you need to tell yourself that the change starts with me so the moment you go to choose someone for that position of leadership you should be also to you should be you should also be ready and cautious enough to choose yourself to do the right thing not just by voting because you cannot sit down and fold your hands and watch one person one person cannot change the whole country it takes every single person and if you everyone keeps on looking at oh hey that celebrity should do this hey that um that rich person should do this hey that poor person should do this hey that person should do this is not going to work don't even look at anybody else do it as a point of service for your children for your coming generation dare to make a difference choose to change you know no matter how much you all try to run away from home to go to another um community or another country to grow yourself and change and you know make money and build something do not forget that at the end of the day there is only one place that you can truly truly call home one place where you are originated from and that place is your home and your home is not going to get better by itself it's not going to get changed by just one leadership or one one choice of election but it also takes each and every one of nigerians who goes out there or who is out there actually so whether you're voting or you're not voting as everybody goes out to vote 
you should also make a choice that from today henceforth you are pledging to be a better citizen a better person to your neighbor a better friend a better son a better daughter a better walker and you know you just are going to be a better person and you're going to contribute to the growth and the betterment of the country yes the money scarcity thing there is a lot of theories out there and it has been crazy and you know nigeria has always been a cash country people don't do credits a lot people don't have don't don't take a lot of loans people work for money people need cash a lot of people really need that cash so the concept of e-money is something that i don't advise um a lot of nigerians to agree to because it's going to cause a lot of control a lot of chaos you, there's going to be a lot of misconceptions and you know like miscommunication in transition do not allow anybody any outside opinion to come in and try to tell you how to live your life how to do your deals and everything you have always been independently independent minded per people of yourself and you should keep up with that don't let the outside influence to to change you one of the reasons why nigeria has been going down the drain is because they've always tried to be like other people they they fight for themselves but they also want want to be like the west you don't need to be like the west you don't need to be like any other person you just have to be yourself the same you that has been working for thousands of years ago that is the same energy you have to continue to bring to the table for the purpose of yourself the purpose of your family and your future generation and in this light i want to say that we're throwing in positive energy out there you know we're throwing in some light some prayers some support and we're hoping that may the best man for the position win and may all the nigerians who are both home and abroad also be determined to be better people wherever you are a better representation of nigeria make nigeria proud not just by voting the right person but also by being the right person so with this i wish everyone a wonderful election period with all wishing you safety wishing you protection and wishing you peace and hope that everything works out just perfectly so please don't hesitate to hit the subscribe button like and comment i hope you love my video bye guys Mwah.